morning everyone uh, it is a Thursday I think I took the day off yesterday uh, we went out or I went out to the girls for the day so there was no vids or no work yesterday we did find some cool places which are going to come on the channel soon um, we did a bit of exploring a bit of reconnaissance yesterday so that's coming at some point if you follow me on instagram you'll have seen the picture of the db uh, and that was obviously where we were but more of that up and coming uh, today i've got um, wayne's mini coming in so we did this car or his old car a little while ago now probably two years ago um, he had a full-on Audison system, sub, speakers, amp, active, working with a factory unit. Uh, today he's bought a new Mini and he's bringing it in. We've got two days on it. Changed some speakers, wiring the 8-channel amp. Um, the integration into the factory system, the sub, put it all back in. So that should be quite cool. I've got some Focal. BMW speakers to put in as well because obviously they're a specific size so they're going in uh, but yeah we've got it for two days and a tune up and obviously make it sounding fantastic like his old one did I'm hoping to be fair there shouldn't be too much change in the system but we'll check it all anyway <laughs> which uh, little old lady staring at my car trying to figure out what it is uh, we should be alright so hopefully that's not going to be too tedious We've had loads of new subscribers. Welcome everyone, thank you for pressing that button. Um, the comments section has been nice and busy. Welcome to my regulars, hello to my regulars, morning to my regulars. Hope you're well. It is, what time we got? 7.03. We're on the hunt to go and get some breakfast. I don't know what to do today. I don't know whether we do bacon or croissant quite like a bit of a croissant in the morning at the minute so I might do that and a coffee. Um, weather's changeable, we're supposed to have two days of sunshine but um, it was kind of a bit grey and overcast and it looks like it's starting off the day the same. So we could be in some more rain for a little bit. Hopefully it's not going to be all weekend but at the same time 22 degrees, 25 degrees and sunny, that's enough. We don't want any more because working in it just gets hot and sticky and horrible. I've had some good comments. Um, I've liked your input massively. It's always nice reading stuff. There's always going to be a difference of opinion. That's fine. That is what it is. But as they say, an opinion without pie is just an onion. See you in a bit. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. then everyone we've got our two-day job in um, it is a brand new mini let me just turn this down so it's basically a special edition got the old retro stripe but with obviously the modern in touches inside so we've got to do speakers in the front door cards speakers in the back door cards we've got an Audison amp and sub and all the cabling and bits and bobs these way rear ones are going to go in there by Eaton and we've got some other ones for the front some focals so we've got a full two days on this it's got some nice carbon fiber touches um, but this is Wayne's little or new toy which we need to get cracking on so I'll come back to you in a bit when we started um, we'll go from there <clears throat> I will see you in a bit. 
Right then, so about an hour and a half in, I've, uh, <laughs> I've done some stuff. So we've got front speakers are in, both mids and tweeters are in the doors. Uh, we need to change out the wiring from the sub that's going to go to this. So at the minute the input comes from the head unit down to this point and then there's basically a feed that goes backwards to the... Uh, sorry, no there's not. So we need to change this. So at the minute there's a, a feed that comes from the head unit down to here and then it bridges off from there and goes back up to the door. We need to separate that so we've got the subs on one channel, mid-range and tweeters on another channel and then the rears, which I'm just starting, they're gonna be on another channel. So it's basically turning an eight channel amplifier into six. We'll bridge up the subs to give him some more mid bass. Mids and tweeters will be mids and tweeters. And then there's a separate AP1 amplifier, which is gonna power that in the boot. So at the minute it's all stripped out. Some of the interior is there, the old front speakers are there. And I'm just getting to grips with that little badger. It's gonna get taken out, put an eating in there. So we'll do that next. And I'll come back to you in a moment. Uh, nearly lunchtime. All right, it's not. It's an hour and a half away, but wishful thinking. Afternoon, everyone. Are you good? So we're cracking on with the mini. Got the sub in. Got the ample wired in. I was having a bit of a moment earlier. It's not an 8.9. I thought it was. It's a, it's a four channel. Um, so we won't be doing active speakers because I forgot we can't. I thought I'd sold him an eight, but uh, we haven't. He bought a four instead. So this and this is not gonna be active as I first presumed. So we're gonna run them as a front channel. Obviously the rears as a rear channel. Um, but other than that, yeah, we've got the rear speakers in. The sub is in, it's all wired. Both sides, we've got them going. The only thing I need to do now is run the inputs from our ins and outs Y lead up to the radio. Take the radio out and fit them in. We've done our battery connection, got our fuse ready to go. I just need to cable tie this across the power loop and then stick it on there. And then it's basically building all the plastics back together, get the car back together, plug into it with my software. Um, it may probably need a firmware update. It's, it's, I should think it's been a while since we've, uh, we've done the firmware on it. So I need to update the software and then give it a retune, make sure I'm happy with it. And then, yeah, play with the settings. Make sure it sounds good for Wayne. But I will come back to you in a mo. See you in a bit. Right then, everyone. We are merrily cracking on. Um, so I've got the mini all back together. I'm just running through the setup. So we've got a test track in the head unit. As you can see there, the bit one, bit drive logo. So we're just doing a sign sweep. So this is gonna obviously de-equalize all the positions in the car. Um, so we figure out a flat EQ curve, correct it, and then tweak it after. So although we have four channels of input, it's only registering sound from two of them. So the rear channels must be so quiet that it can't even make it out. Um, but we're all connected for four channels, so I've just changed the setup to front and aux only. So it's now deriving every sound from the front channels because it likes those nice and clear. We're just doing our usual uh, de-equalization. So it's looking at the track, getting rid of that EQ curve that's already placed on the head unit so we can have it back to a flat response. So I'm gonna run through this, get this sorted, set up the speakers, and I'll come back to you in a mo. Right then, everyone. That's Thursday done. Oh, Friday tomorrow. Um, we've pretty much got the mini toasted and done. I've set up the stereo. Uh, done all the time alignment and everything like that and I'm pretty pleased with where it is. I think uh, Wayne will be happy with it. We've gone through different setup than it had last time. Um, it was ages ago that I did that one, but you always learn a little bit more. So it's had a few more sort of up-to-date tricks and you know, there's always room for improvement. As they say, nothing's perfect. But I've got it kind of where I want it. Uh, he will come tomorrow and we'll have a little listen and a play and I'm sure if there's anything missing or if, you know, he wants something different, he'll let me know. But other than that, we are done for Thursday. Uh, I don't know whether you've noticed there's a, the rattle on the GoPro is gone. 
the um, the screws on the little clip on this GoPro Hero, uh, two of them had fallen out and the base itself was just wobbling around completely loose. Um, so the curse of the action camera strikes again. I'm gonna start creating lots of tickets for GoPro to get all this stuff sent away uh, and either replaced or refunded because to be fair, it's not cheap stuff. I wouldn't mind if it was crap, but it's, you know, when I bought them, they're like 375 pound cameras. It's not like they're cheap. I kind of expected a bit more, certainly a bit more reliability. So they're gonna go back to GoPro. We need to get that sorted. But other than that, Thursday's done. I'll see you bright and early for Friday's little chat and work tomorrow on the mini completes. See you soon. You told me you had subscribed to ASC Audio and now you've missed an episode. No!